I'd like to share three simple steps to begin creating synergy. And they are, number one, to begin with the end in mind. Do we know what the objective of our conversation is? And believe it or not, this step is, uh, it requires a lot of dialogue because what could be the end in mind for one person might not be for the other. So let me give you a simple example and one that can be, uh, that many people can relate to. Let's say they are in a relationship. One wants to make a decision. The other one doesn't approve the decision because it doesn't work for him or herself or her. Let's say Mary and Peter. Mary wants to have children in their family, but Peter is not ready to have children. Now, what would be the end in mind? The end in mind would not be that one or the other gets their needs fulfilled, but that perhaps something even higher above each other's personal agendas, perhaps that they have a harmonious relationship, a joyful relationship, an effective relationship, just to move away from the personal agendas, to be able to come up with uh, an objective, a vision, a mission that is higher. That's step number one. Because now having that objective, then what happens is each person could write down what is the benefit uh, for each of them. Let's say, Peter, what is the benefit of not having children? Or why does he not want to have children? And then Mary, why does she want to have children? What are her needs? And then look at each other's needs. Now, the next step, which is one that uh, I missed before in my interactions, is to sit down and have what is called a brainstorming session. Looking at both uh, lists, what will be a, a, a solution? What will be a way of solving or getting to that objective? Not to that personal agendas, but to the objective that really is uh, is a need for both of the participants. So having a brainstorming session, lots of ideas, even a wacky idea, or even a wild idea, writing them down quickly uh, among you know the two or the three, whoever whoever is involved, and then finally, out of that brainstorming session of all those ideas, create using imagination, using self-awareness, using a wheel, using many of the abilities that are given to us by our creator to come up with a third alternative that perhaps is completely different from what each of them expected or perhaps has some elements of what each of them needed uh, to be fulfilled and to achieve that objective. Please send me a message at Esperanza Montalvo Leadership with Awareness and we'll have a conversation on this. The idea is to begin having uh, conversations to dismantle uh, conflict, to dismantle differences, to dismantle communication, and to really unpack what leadership and communication is. Join us.